After you have completed this tutorial you will understand the DHT sensor and its characteristics. You will work with a DC motor, the TIP120 transistor, and the diode for fan control. For implementation on the smart home for seniors house model you need the following. A Raspberry Pi Pico. A full-size breadboard. A micro USB cable. Several male to male jumper wires. The DHT11 sensor. A fan. The diode, and. The TIP120 transistor. At least three installation steps are required for installing and controlling the temperature with the temperature and humidity sensor. First, install the sensors. Secondly, connect the electronics. Thirdly, write a program code. The DHT11 sensor needs to be mounted on the backside wall of the smart home for seniors house model. Therefore use two bolts and two nuts. You need to bend the blue part of the sensor forward to access the mounting holes. Then mount the sensor through the top left and top right mounting holes. An additional, on the left side piece you will need to mount a DC fan and an LED light. For the DC fan please use 4 bolts and 4 nuts. Insert the LED to the mounting hole. Friction will keep it in place. To connect the electronics of the DHT11 sensor, you have to Connect the red cable to 3V3 rail Connect the black cable to GND rail Connect the green cable to GPIO8 pin For the connection of the TIP120 transistor and the fan you have to Connect the red cable from the fan to the 5 volt rail Connect the black cable from the fan to the middle pin of the TIP120 transistor. Then, connect the black cable from the TIP120 transistor to GND rail. Now, connect the diode from the middle pin of the TIP120 transistor to the GND rail. And connect the yellow cable to GPIO9 pin. For generating the program code you will find a detailed description in the learning module. Please follow the instructions there. You will learn how the software and hardware components work together. And, you will get to know more about Thonis environment and its additional functions. A security system using the before-mentioned sensors.